Hey everyone, Gallifrey Forever 97 here. Welcome to today's video. We'll be reacting and breaking down the news that season 24 will be the next after season 8, which will be hopefully released in March, is the next Blu ray box set to come out. We've had season 26, which is the final Sylvester McCoy series, but now we're jumping to the start. There's an eight minute announcement trailer, so I'm gonna to react to that. That must be the longest one they've ever done, so that's exciting. But after that, I'm gonna be breaking down all the content, let you know what is contained in this set. Before I start though, uh, if you're not yet, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Uh, I do trailers, reactions and tributes and dot two news. If ever that takes you fancy, uh, feel free to subscribe. This is called A Business Proposal for Mel. I'm sure it's written by Pete McTeague, but without that I have no idea what this is going to be. Without further ado, let's react. Oh, very uh, 80s. <laughs> Meet Melanie Bush. Hey, Bonnie Langford. Is that the Dragon's Den narrator? Oh my goodness, they're doing an ace at change and be like, where did she go? Oh, it's the uh, Down the Bannerman uh, bus. Hopeful investors are docking at Mel's space station. Wow, this is great. Wow, this is amazing to do with CGI stuff. I love how this is a rip off of Dragon's Den. This is brilliant. <laughs> Who's in the chair? Oh. Oh, how glorious. <laughs> the refurbished Paradise Towers. Oh my! Space tourism is having a tough time right now. It'll bounce back. It was a bit different than last tower time. Block, Paradise Towers had quite the reputation. Yeah. <laughs> Rigorous safety checks. Most of them. That's good to know, but I don't think I want to say that. <laughs> Sorry, it's not a twenty-four carat business. <gasps> it hurt. <laughs> Next to try their luck. It's my. Patent oh, Dragonfire. Call it Mr. Melody. Guaranteed to strip away the ravages of time. Oh, that's such an iconic moment. Which one of you is <laughs> beautiful? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was, we'll a, that was very evil. Trap. Oh, my God. I don't know if that's the original costume or someone's actually eyes. made that, especially for oh. this. <laughs> I can't run away! Final mysterious visitor will have better luck. It's gotta be the seventh doctor. Not Luke Skywalker. Hello. What's so oh. The person who's playing them, yeah. <laughs> he's in costume! Oh Woo. Oh my god. That was great. <laughs> right, what's on this? New documentaries. Andrew had a clear view of where he wanted the show to go. Oh, interesting. To talk about when he made his debut five decades Matthew ago. Matthew Sweet. And he's been oh, he's doing one with Sylvester. Oh, that's great. I had no idea what I was going to do. I wasn't really told I was saying they're done with Bonnie that, so in the season 23 one. To learn about it. The character I was playing was... Oh! I first played my favourite story from season 24. It's such a fun a adventure. Shack. Probably had lots of green babies. <laughs> Here we are to celebrate season 24. Hey, oh, Dr. Sable. Clive great. That was a great feature on season 23, Lassie. so I'm glad to see us returned. Oh, this complete classic lineup. I like how it's like each one of the 80s story. team in a way. I think getting a bit much. From the BBC archives. Oh. Let's the world! <laughs> Doctor Who, the collection. Season 24 is available <laughs> to pre order now. I need to pre-order it. I think they call it a box set. Oh my now that's goodness. 24 carat. Uh, Come uh, on, uh. let's watch one. What do you fancy? Maybe not the Tetras. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was Too lovely. Fun. The Doctor and Mel's adventures. Oh. Well done, Pete Fatigue. Well done, everybody involved. That was really fun. <laughs> So that was the announcement trailer. Like they put a lot of effort into it anyway, but that was glorious. That was such a fun little adventure. A funny version of like what they did with the uh, Ace one, uh, where the Doctor kind of goes back to see uh, Ace after all these years, and obviously now he's gone on to continue adventures with uh, Mel. So yeah, that was a nice little epilogue to season 24. So looking at the announcement page on the official Doctor Who website, it says Sylvester McCoy's first season as the 7th Doctor, featuring a full season of Boy Langford as Melanie Bush, is the next release to come 
to Blu-ray with season 24. It tells you where you can pre-order it. So it's got Amazon, Zave, HMV in the UK, Sanity and JB in Australia and Amazon for the US. I usually pre-order it from Zoom, so hopefully they'll have it. I don't know. A glorious look at Lee Biden's cover. It's got purpley overtone with the massive stars in the background. The seventh doctor, grin his funny smile. In his hand, he has his famous spoons from Time of the Rani. But the monster display, we got the Rani in the center, Tetrap at the bottom, the monster from Dragonfire, the robot from Paradise Towers, Gavrock from Delta and the Bannerman, and Richard Breers at the top playing the chief caretaker from Paradise Towers. The article breaks down uh, the monsters as well features as so the Doctor's face with enemies including the Rani, Kate O'Mara, and the terrifying tech traps in Time and the Rani. Prognon and his cleaning robots in Paradise Towers, the ruthless Bannerman in Delta and the Bannerman, and Kane, the murderous ruler of Iceworld in Dragonfire. Then we got a full display photo which sees all the discs, the front cover of the leaflet and inside the box set. So looking at the discs, we've got one with the ties, which I assume will probably be the bonus features one. We've got the girl from Delta and the Bannerman one, the old women from Paradise Towers. There's one which looks like a screenshot from Dragonfire, which is the Doctor looking at Mel. At the bottom, we've got the Seventh Doctor, Mel in that bubble uh, from Time of the Rani. The Seventh Doctor in his Sixth Doctor costume post-regeneration. And a close-up of the Doctor and Mel on another. The front of the leaflet is from Dragonfire, so you've got the ice sculptures in the background. You can just see Ace peering out of the back saying, Hello, I'm the next companion. And the front case inside is from Paradise Towers, I believe. With an ominous shadow, which I assume will probably be the cleaner robot. From that story. But I love the lighter overall purple tone, which is a nice homage to the season 18 one, which is more of a darker purple, which represents like the stories and, and the tone of the season. With all episodes new remastered, this Blu-ray box set set also contains extensive and exclusive special features, including extended versions for all four stories, so Time and the Rani, Paradise Towers, Delta and the Bannerman, and Dragonfire, featuring previously untransmitted material. It's amazing how they've scavenge all this kind of material and piece together new uh, versions of these episodes. Immersive five point surround sound and isolated scores are presented for all of the episodes. Brand new documentaries including a feature length overview of season 24. You can see the trailer with the interviews with Andrew Cartmel, Boy Langford and Sylvester McCoy talking about where obviously they were wanting to go with the characters and how their ideas were executed and, and then they came to fruition and this is called Here's to the Future plus a new making of documentary for Delta and the Bannerman, which I think is my favourite story from that season, so I'm glad that's getting the new documentary treatment. Rare studio and location footage, over 25 hours of raw material, never seen before, including behind the scenes footage from the regeneration scene. Wow. That famous regeneration scene where uh, there was the seventh doctor in Colin Baker's wig. That's going to be fun seeing it just sitting there. Matthew Sweet's In Conversation series continues with Sylvester McCoy, fitting as it is his first season. They've done Mel and Sophie Olgers is fitting now. Uh, that we get in Sylvester McCoy, so it'll be great extensive chat on his career before and after Doctor Who. Four new episodes of Behind the Sofa, and each sofa of the three represents an era of the 80s. So on one sofa, we've got Sylvester McCoy, Boy Langford, and Sophie Aldridge to represent the Seventh Doctor era, Peter Davison, Janet Fielding, and Sarah Sutton for the Fifth Doctors, and Colin Baker and Michael Jason, who played the Valley Yard. Uh, for the sixth Doctor era. The Doctor's Table uh, continues, that was seen in season 23, and that was a, such a fun thing where they uh, open tins asking questions. It's a really great idea, part of like Chris Chapman's uh, great documentary ideas. And this includes Sylvester McCoy, Boy Langford, Sophie Aldred, and Clive Merrison, which brings up some great memories about uh, season 24. Rare gems from the archives, hours of footage covering the promotion of this season, including lots of previously unreleased material. That'd be interesting to see how uh, they promoted it and if it's unseen stuff, it'd be interesting to see what it comes from what, so I'm very excited to see that. An audience of Lady Strevens, a brand new interview with season 24 actor and Rocky Horror Cult figure Patricia Quinn. They've done it a couple of times before where they'll probably take an actor who they may have not interviewed on like previous DVD releases and stuff. Convention footage, unseen HD photos, info text, behind the scenes information and trivia in every episode, scripts, costume designs, rare BBC production files and other rarities from the archive. And if that's not enough, much, much more. It's an eight-day spot set and also all the other stuff that was also released on DVD 
will be on the Blu-ray from like the DVD special features. They also give us a summary about the special shot announcement trailer, which is read and directed by Pete Mateague, who wrote Kablam and Praxis for series 11 and 12. Obviously all the cameos from all different characters from season 24. And there's a great photo gallery as well of when they shot it. So that would be great uh, to delve into those images. There we go. That's the trailer and all the special features that are coming with this new season 24 release. It's great to know another classic season box set is coming. Of course, we've got season 8 to look forward to and that's probably coming now early March has been pushed around due to obviously a lockdown stuff and all that shenanigans but it's nice to know that we've also got another one in the pipeline jump into the 80s uh, giving us another season of Svesta McCoy so as always please comment like and subscribe you can follow on Twitter Facebook Instagram links to the social media pages in the description below what's your favorite story from season 24 about the new features what are you most looking forward to all your thoughts on the new release let me know in the comment section below. But until next time, thank you very much for watching. Bye bye.